buddy and Stephanie from the Denman Homestead here. And um, I got Steph a little surprise. A little something that I think she, I know she's going to love. So, <clears throat> if you didn't, well, you should know because our dryer went out. Steph has been homesteading it up in the backyard with clothes pins and clothes lines. Um, I've been a real pioneer woman. Yeah, but that was how well, I used to. My when I was little, my clothes. My mom always put our clothes out on a clothesline. Like yeah. I, I love the smell of air dried clothes. Uh, kind of took me back a little bit. But anyway. Yeah, I talked to your mom about that day. She's like, were your like sheets and towels a little crispy? And I was like, yes. They were. They were yeah. She's like, yeah, just throw them back in the dryer for like five minutes and it like softens them up. I was like, oh, such a good yeah. idea. Yeah. But anyway, I've been having, you know, a little bit of a time. I don't know if it's the heat or what, but like everything has just been kind of one of those like seasons of life where it just feels like nothing's going right. So Steph, for Christmas got everyone birdhouses. Everyone in the family got birdhouses and some or of bird them feeders. or bird feeders, yeah. Some of them are really cool, the bird feeders that you can actually stick onto your window so you can watch the birds fly up outside of your window and, and get the food. Yeah, they're like a clear f bird feeder. But I love birds. Check this out. This right here is the Bill and Tan um, Smart Bird Feeder. Yes. Bird feeders have gotten smart, guys. But man, when I saw this thing... Guys, I have seen one of these. Like, sometimes this comes up on, like, your, like, recommended for you, like, ads and stuff. Yeah. This thing is awesome. It's like a ring doorbell, right? So when there's motion at your door, you can pull up your phone and, and see what like who's at your front door but it's for birds and you can even listen to them you can listen to them it's got this like smart bird recognition that will tell you like even what type of bird it is i mean i night vision it's wide angle it can recognize 6000 species of birds yeah. And 350 species of hummingbirds. Yep. I... Oh, you know what? I should talk about this. I told Daniel about this on Sunday. Oh, you sure did. The app? That yeah. cool app? So there's an app. By the way, we're not affiliated. Yeah, no, no affiliation. There, there's an app called Merlin, and it's, uh, it's by the Cornell Lab. It's called Merlin. If anyone's interested in birds or bird watching, anything like that, Buddy, this app is so cool. First say, like, you said something like, this may be really, what did you say? I don't know. This might. It, I said it might be, like, the oldest thing I've ever done or, or the oldest person thing I've ever done or something <laughs> like that. But I was tell, I was all excited about that. And, and my coworker, who's younger than me, m much younger than me, is the one that told me about, about this app. And it is awesome. So it's called Merlin. And you download it, and you... Pick what, what area of the world or the country, wherever you pick your area, and it downloads a little pack. And then you just start, you let it listen, and you set it out, and you let it listen to birds. And it picks out all the different birds that it can hear and, like, separates them out and all kinds of cool, awesome stuff like that. Like, it's just a super cool app to be like, I wonder what that bird is. And then you look, and it's, uh, it's on your phone. And it's anyway. free, right? Yeah, it's free, completely free. I told Buddy it probably just pick up a bunch of cicadas. Yeah, you like, have the wild cicada birds. Yeah. Anyway, let's open this guy up. Okay. I show them this picture. I don't know oh, that yeah. you did show them that picture first. Which one did I get? So of this one? it's it's uh, solar powered, so it gets its own energy. Which one is, is ours? I'll show you. Because there's a little attachments that you can do for different ones. There's even a bird bath. Attachment. A bird bath? Yeah. I can attach it to this? But but the bird bath one though, I didn't know if it was gonna spray all of the food because it's like bird food and bath. Uh, so I wasn't sure. 
And you know what's so crazy? When I when Buddy gave this to me today, I was like, this is how much bird seed I have left. Like, of my, like, I feel like it's just enough. And I have hummingbird food too. Yeah. So this is the one on this attachment. Or for this one, you can put the bird seed tray and then even attach to the bird seed tray the, the hummingbird feeder so you can get both. This is like the best day of my life. Nice big strap. And you know these poor birds are hungry and thirsty. Packaging is actually really nice. Very compact. Everything had its little spot in there. Sorry. I was just... By the way, this is a natural red color, no artificial dyes, hummingbird food. I think it's like with beet juice or something. So here is the, the base like setup. The food actually goes in all around the camera. And um, that is just so crazy amazing. Yeah, it's it's almost like a baby monitor, but for birds. For birds. Super cool. So now we gotta figure out how it all goes together. Is there was there an instruction book? Yes, we did. You can either strap it to a tree. You can either strap the metal base to a tree, or you can screw the metal base to a tree. Oh, I see. So that's how, that's the mounting. Okay. So, you have two different options. You've got, so this is the mounting bracket. You can screw it directly into a post, or if you want to do like an actual tree, you could take this strap and wrap it around, ratchet it. Okay, so, first step for assembly. Download. Oh, that's the app. You want to download the app while I'm doing yeah. this? I don't know if my ancient phone can handle it. So download the Bill and Tan app with that QR code. They give you the QR code in the instructions that take you straight to the app. It's, instructions really actually look super simple. It's the it's the bottom of one page. That's like that's all it is. Oh, but is it like my um, garden cart? Oh no. Okay, what it says that? do the solar panel first. That's the hummingbird food. Food. Hummingbird food. Yeah, for hummingbirds. But that's the liquid. Solar panel. Here. Oh. Okay. So the base is actually the base for the solar panel is built into the roof. That's really cool. Yeah. So this actually is like not very many pieces. That's kind of awesome. Okay. So the lid just sits down on top, and the solar panel actually moves out of the way, so you can fill, fill it up. It. Yeah. How smart is that? Yeah. They really thought of that. Yeah. That's really smart. Oh. oh, just a little extra oomph. So you basically slide it open and then you just put a little pressure and it pops over this little ridge right here and it'll come off. So, not bad. Screw in there. Can you download footage? We shall see. I bet, I bet if we can download footage, my family is going to get so tired of birds. Like, 
all the bird food. Uh, I'm gonna be like, buddy, look at this bird that came today. Okay, you have to pair it. All right, so now that the solar panel mount is screwed on to the base, I'm gonna slide it back. Slide it back on. Is that, is that solar panel? Is it? The camera, the camera like tilts out, so you can access the stuff. Mm. That's what I was trying to figure out how how it works. We're lucky. It does have an SD card storage, but you would basically have to take the SD card out and then download the data onto your computer in order to view it. Yeah. If you don't do the cloud-based storage. I wonder how long, how, how much, how the solar charges it, like, what's the storage time? Okay. Welcome to Smart Battery Camera. It's talking to us. Please open your mobile app to start adding devices. Ooh, it said, welcome to Smart Battery Camera. Open your battery, open your app to start adding devices. Steph's doing that. I'm sliding the tray onto the front. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. And then you could continue it out even further with the oh, let's take the take the bird landers out. Press the reset button for three to five seconds to reset the device until a beep sounds. Confirm that device indicator flashes slowly, or there is a device prompt tone. Did it beep? Yeah, I heard it beep. Bill Tanyan's request location permission. It's asking to choose the Wi Fi, so I guess this one right here. Yeah. Align the QR code towards the lens until you hear the prompt. Scanned successfully, and the network is being configured. So it just scans your camera, your your QR code, and it connects it to the internet. And it's saying it's connecting on my phone. We'll spill it. Okay, we had some struggle getting it to sync because we, both of us, did not notice that we had to put type the Wi-Fi password in. We were just hitting next and then wondering why it wasn't connecting. It was user error. Yeah, alright, so what do we want to call this device? Um, the Denman Homestead Bird Feeder. You see the bird seed? Tilt the camera up a little so we can... Oh, yeah. Angle it. It even has a date and time. Is that the right time? No. Almost. It's an hour off. I guess we could we could probably adjust that in settings. Mm -hmm. this is so I'm amazed at how clear this picture is. I'm honestly just amazed in general. Okay. Well. Oh. Don't grab it by the tray! Because it will slip off. Okay. Alright. So, uh, you want to load the bird, the hummingbird stuff, and I'll get this little bracket strapped up. Okay. Uh oh. 
It's hummingbird food. I filled it up right to the 14 ounce marker. bracket is on the tree. The strap was too wide, so we just screwed it. Slides into place. Might have to trim a few leaves to get the sun on that panel. Yeah, probably gonna have to do something about the sun here, but... Okay, now we just wait for beautiful bird footage. That is so awesome. Look out the window, you can see it. Out the window too. Connor, look at this bird. Look at this bird that we can see. Oh my gosh. I know, they just landed and started eating. Because it was right by the other bird feeder. Mm -hmm. I'm never going to get anything else done. <laughs> like, guarantee, I will get no things done. You're going to come home from work, and I will be late about... This is the, this is the best thing. Alright, so that is super cool and super easy to put together. I'll put a link to it in the description if you are interested in checking one out. Do you like it, babe? I absolutely love it, and I cannot wait. Yeah, it's going to be great. All right, well, catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.